Hello, this is Tony at Tony's Music and Administrator of Graphical Designs. I want to show you how um, I create my QR codes. I use an app called QRverse, and as you can see, I'm going to sign in now, so I'll log in. And I'm going to create a QR code, and I just click on there. Then I want a website QR code. And what I do is you put your website in there. Oops, that's not the one. So what I need to do is I need to go in another app. Hang on a moment. Just do that. Go over there. Put marks down there. There it is. Right. One moment. I'm sorry about this. I just got to get me um, site details up there. Link address, okay. I'm going to just get that off there. I'm just going to go paste on there. Right, so there's my website that I've got, which is a holiday website. So um, I'm going to put that on. So I'll just create a code for that. So all I did was put my URL in, right? Now, it's come up with this QR code preview. That's what it looks like so far, but that's just a preview. We obviously want it to be sunny and light. So we're gonna use yellow and orangey colors. Like that. Maybe yellow and more, more yellow color. Perhaps, yeah, drawing yellow. I said like that. And then I want dark colors for the inside otherwise it won't count it so the black should be okay but i can um add an additional color to it so i'm gonna enable a gradient on there by clicking that across there right and i want the one to be a different color so we have like a purple you know, purple like that so you can do that look see. so so you got like a gradient in there, as you can see, that's what I've just done, right? I could have changed this one to a different colour if I wanted to as well, like a red. But I think black would be better, so I'm going to do it that way, right? Now you can have it linear or radial, if you have it radial, you go in the middle. But if you're going to have a logo in there, you're going to miss off it. So I'd rather have linear on this occasion, because I'm going to put a logo in the middle. Right now, if you want to do change what's in the middle, you can change them. So you can have a shape like that, shape like the circles, diamonds, stars, smaller diamonds, heart shapes, this squiggly kind of shape, that kind of shape, that kind of shape, or that one. We'll go for that one on this occasion, right? We might make it a bit star, starry, shiny type of thing. We've got different shapes for the outsides here of these. So we can have the square, this shape, this shape, this shape, and so on. Going through different shapes there. I prefer this one, but half the time that one doesn't work. I don't know why that one doesn't work so well, but there's a problem with it, I think. It doesn't seem to work off the time, but I'll show you now. Uh, as well as that, you can change the colour of those. So if we enable the colours, we change the colour of that to like, something like red. And now the inner one's purple or something, but change them as well. You can change them all the centres. You can have that. You can have the square. You can have a shape. You know, you can have similar shapes to what the outside is, really, as well. You got these as well, so you can have different shapes. I prefer to have something like that, or that one, or this one, or this one. Right, so that one would probably be the best of that. But I'm going to change the colour of that anyway, so that's going to be blue colour. Blue colour there. Uh -uh. Don't. That'll be alright, I think. So we've got them colours, right? Now, we've done all that. We've messed about with it. We've done a lot of things with it. 
now you can add your logo so add a custom logo now I've got a custom logo here for the holiday site I've got I'm going to add that there it is in the middle can you see it yeah just about it's very small but if you have it too big it will affect your uh, QR code right and then you can add an outside you can have, uh, like that 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 one the phone or this one I like this one it's like the clapperboard you know um, you can have that one and you can change the label from scan me to put the B as in capital book. book now so you know it's not the D book now book on there right book on money right so that looks pretty cool so we do that you can change the frame colour to a different colour you want or red or blue or red or green yeah, or yellow, not that, but well, I think I prefer the black actually, but uh, there you go, well, you can change that as well, so anyway, once you've done all that and you're ready, then all you got to do is click the done for there, you click the title project, booking, holidays we'll call that and we'll select a folder default folder and you can change it to dynamic if you wish uh, if you do it it's static that means it's just one for that particular website and if you change something to do with the website you'll have to get a new one but if you got it in dynamic you can keep the same one if you want to right so that's that it's generating the QR code now it hopefully should work in a moment there you go and all you got to do then is download as a PNG, download as a SVG, and you can download the copy link as well if you wish. Right, so I've got the copy link as well. Right, so if you go on to a separate site, it'll show that on a site. So if you do that, and then go like that, it'll come up with the QR code, and then I can scan it. Now, that's how it works but it's simple you don't add nothing just a URL and that's all that goes in there and just the image that you've made it into and that's basically everything to do with a QR code I hope you enjoyed this uh, tutorial and hope you find it useful um, anyway um, if you do please like and subscribe to Tony's Music and have a good day thank you